So you guys know I've been married for six years, ten months, and four days up to this point, and so I do have a little bit of experience interacting with my wife, so anything I'm about to say does not necessarily apply to large amounts of people or to women in general, but this is just my experience with my wife, and I thought that I might be able to give a little bit of insight on how I respond and how she appreciates how I listen. So on the way home from church today, my wife and I were having a discussion and she asked, how have I learned to resist the urge to fix a problem if she's venting or telling me about something? Because as a guy, quite honestly, my first temptation when a problem is presented to me, like if some somebody hurt her in some way or frustrated her in some way, is to, to take that problem and... So the first thing when we're in conversation and she's telling me something about how she feels or a problem that she's having, I need to recognize that she probably already has a solution to the problem. She's actually talking to me because I'm her husband, she wants to let me know what's going on, but she's not necessarily talking to me and telling me the problem so I can fix it. I know as a guy my tendency is when I hear a problem I immediately try to come up with a bunch of solutions and fix it because I'm a problem solver, but that's not the purpose of the conversation at this point, so I had to train myself to recognize that no, she she already probably has a solution to this problem, so it's my job to hear her out. The second thing I need to realize is that the reason why she's talking to me is because she loves me and she wants me to just know what's going on in her life. I mean, the basic definition of relationship and friendship, that each person shares their life with each other. I need to recognize that when she's talking to me and telling me about problems and stuff, even though I want to fix them, I know that the underlying goal of the conversation is to include me in her life, and I need to reciprocate that as well. It comes down to it, if I am in a conversation with her and I honestly don't know if I should be providing solutions, I will outright ask, do you need me to listen right now, or do you need me to fix this problem? That has gone over extremely well and has helped me be more comfortable in those conversations where I do have the urge to fix it, but she goes, no, I, I just need you to listen right now. And I'm like, okay, now I know what the expectations are, I'm able to relax and really focus and pay attention. Sometimes it is better to brew her a cup of tea than to take on the world on her behalf without her wanting you to. So that's it for today. I hope you're having a good weekend, and I will see you guys next time.